Skaters, welcome back. I'm so glad you're here. I am Coach Julia and today we're going to be starting something a little bit different here on YouTube. I am going to be teaching you a series of hit exercises that we're going to then put together in a couple weeks into a hit workout. If you don't know what a hit workout is, it's a high intensity interval training. These are incredible for building up cardiovascular health and strength in our body at the same time. If you've ever come out and done a program and been completely winded when you get off, you know you need that really good heart health and lung capacity to pull off a program of any length. And so doing a HIIT workout is going to somewhat give us that same feeling where we're going to do one skill after another in re repetition over and over and over and get our heart rate going up so that we're uh, mimicking the feeling of a program. But since these are going to be a number of exercises you might not have learned yet, I'm going to be teaching them to you one at a time so you can practice them, get that skill down, and then we'll put it together in a HIT workout with a playlist down the road once we have a few of these different exercises in our stockpile. Today we're going to start with something called curtsy lunges. You might have seen these in other places. It's a pretty common skating workout, but I'm going to show you how this is done. They're done on our inside edges and we're going to be doing them going around the rink. So what we're going to do is we're going to step deep onto our inside edge and curtsy and then deep onto the other edge and curtsy. All right, let's do that with some speed. So we're going to go around the rink doing this. I'm gonna step onto my right foot, extend my hands, point my toe at a 45 degree angle, and then I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna curtsy and come up. All of that done on my inside edge. Left inside edge, curtsy, come up. Right inside edge, curtsy, come up. So there's a few things you should know about this particular curtsy lunge. Well, your extended leg, should not be straight out to the side, should not be straight behind you. You want it at a 45 degree angle. This is using your gluteus medius. So you have three sectors of your glutes. You have the gluteus maximus, which is straight down the back, and the gluteus minimus, which is on the side. And on the kind of the corner is the gluteus medius. And when you lift that leg, you wanna be engaging that medius muscle. So you get that nice 45 degree angle, okay? This is gonna make those buns look really good. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. So we're gonna step on the inside edge, curtsy, so you're going down into those quads, you're engaging the front of your leg, then you're extending up. You're gonna step wide, use that gluteus medius, curtsy, engage those quads, extend again. Step, curtsy, extend. Now to help you maintain control, your hands are gonna be side to side. They're gonna come down in front of you, but you wanna extend your inside hand in front as you rise back up. If you go back to a square position, you're probably gonna lose control and spin out. So we're gonna step hand side to side, go down into your curtsy, and then extend your inside hand out in front. Step curtsy, extend the inside hand out in front. So those are curtsy lunges. It's a simple motion, but uses a lot of strength, okay? It's gonna really build up those glutes, really build up those quads, and at the same time, we can be putting all of that artistry into it with our upper body. So I mentioned that artistry aspect. We always wanna be working on the artistry of our skating. Yes, the strength and the skills are important, but if you go out to do a performance and you've never worked on the, the arms, the head, the flow, it's gonna show, okay? You're gonna look a little clunky out on the ice. So we wanna have those soft feathery hands. We wanna follow our chin through where we're going with our arms. So let's talk about that while we're skating. So we're gonna step, we're gonna have those soft hands, those soft fingers. They're gonna come down into a gentle circle. Okay, if you've ever been in ballet, you'll recognize this position. And then they're going to reach out. And you're gonna lift that chin over those fingers. Then we're gonna step those soft fingers, soft elbows, go down into a circle. Try to get it below your knee if you can. And then we're gonna reach out and that chin is gonna lift over your fingers. So we want that full, squeeze your shoulders together, go down, 
reach up. Squeeze your shoulder blades together like you're squeezing a lemon. Reach all the way down, get your back into it. Reach up. So when your arms are extended, I want you to imagine you're squeezing your shoulder blades together like you're squeezing a lemon, okay? Then when we go down, we're gonna cup our whole body. So we're make, like we're hugging a ball, okay? So we're going from this open position to a little ball so that our hands are down and our head and our shoulders are mimicking that. And then we're gonna reverse and we're gonna go all the way tall up again. So we have a big contrast in our arms, in our shoulders, and where our head is looking. Let's put this all together. Okay, skaters, I hope you enjoyed this HIT exercise for today. Now, again, we have another one coming up this Thursday. That'll be our HIT exercise number two. So you wanna come back so you can learn that one. And of course, we'll have another one next Sunday and another one next Thursday, and we'll wrap it all up on the first Sunday of October. So you wanna learn each one of these, get those details down, get it so you can do them really strong, put a lot of energy into it, get that heart rate up, and then we can put all these little exercises into one complete workout. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give us that thumbs up. And as always, I'm looking forward to reading all your comments in that section down below. If you haven't done so yet, then hit that subscribe button and the little notification bell down in the corner so you can see all my videos when they come out. Happy skating, and I'll see you next time.